just prior to this meeting, the family had a private meeting with our... Fortunately, in this case, we quickly apprehended the person that we believe is responsible for this horrific attack in our town. And we did it with help from the public and from our law enforcement partners. Always been there for anyone who ever needed to reach out to them. At this point in time, I'd like to... It is a complex investigation because we, too, want to know why this individual went to that location, what connection, if any, there was to the congregation or the, the rabbi or that house. That's part of the investigation. We want to know why, just like you want to know why. And we're working hard to try to figure that out. It's going to take time. I hope we can come back with an answer. But know this, we're going to do everything, and I mean everything, that we can possibly do to figure it out. By Mr. Thomas or previously lived in there, um, and they found some more writings and pill bottles. So the state police have agreed to take certain steps to enhance uh, police visibility in the town of Ramapo. The sheriff's department has done the same. Our agency is also taking steps, and we've received offers from just about every police department in Rockland County to do that. I previously lived in there, um, and they found some more writings and pill bottles. In addition to the increased police patrols and police uh, physical presence, we are going to install license plates, license plate readers, ringing the town. Every entrance and exit road from the town, we intend to have a license plate reader, as well as within the town. As we know, this individual was apprehended due to the fact that license plate readers are installed on the George Washington Bridge and in the city of New York, and he was captured uh, very shortly once he, got into, once he got off the bridge. By having license plate readers in the town, we might have been able to stop him before he even left the town of Ramapo, before he left Muncie.